Samsung is reportedly gearing up to launch a new Galaxy AI tool designed to summarize notifications for its users. This feature, which the Korean tech giant might introduce with One UI 7.0, has recently been making waves because it seems to take inspiration from Apple. Here's the twist. Samsung could be on track to deliver it even better. Notification summaries on iOS are part of Apple's intelligent sweep, which at present is available only in English, with Apple planning to expand support to a few more languages in 2025. Samsung, by contrast, already offers Galaxy AI in multiple languages, so if notification summaries come to One UI, it's likely that they will support more than just English. According to a recent rumor via Chun Bai, Samsung's notification summaries may be offered in several languages, including English, Chinese, Vietnamese, Thai, Japanese, and French. If we were to speculate, we'd say notification summaries could become available in every language that Galaxy AI supports. Samsung's Galaxy AI is already accessible in 20 languages with multiple dialects, with more on the way. Between the two companies, Samsung and Apple, it appears that Samsung is truly pushing to democratize generative AI, aiming to make AI-based tools accessible to as many people, regions, and languages as possible. Currently, the list of Galaxy AI tools that use language recognition includes Live Translate, Call Translate, Chat Assist, Interpreter, Note Assist, Transcript Assist, and Browsing Assist. That said, Samsung hasn't confirmed anything regarding AI-based notification summaries yet so it's worth waiting to see how this unfolds. What are your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comments section. The latest update to Autoblocker for One UI 6.11, version 1.100.28, introduces several new features with more on the horizon. The change log reveals that additional security enhancements will activate once the upcoming One UI 7.0 update is released for Samsung Galaxy devices. In version 1.100.28, Autoblocker strengthens security on One UI 6.11 devices by introducing a maximum restrictions mode first introduced earlier this summer. This mode now includes even tighter controls, such as blocking actions from device admin apps and work profiles when it's enabled. Looking ahead, the change log for Autoblocker indicates that with One UI 7.0, maximum restrictions mode will receive three additional features blocking USB connections, blocking 2G network access, and preventing automatic reconnection to non-secure Wi-Fi networks. While Samsung is focused on delivering the One UI 7.0 beta update, it is also working on new security updates for its smartphones and tablets. What are your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comments section.